Hey everybody, Tuner here. I hope you're doing well. Coming to you today with a bit of an update for the channel. As many of you are aware, Jinx will be taking a step back from YouTube work full time. I want to say out of the gate that I fully support this. If he's not finding happiness or monetary sustainability here, then I fully support him finding other avenues. With that said, there are a few questions about the state of the channel going forward. I was going to make this video earlier, but I didn't think it would make sense without Jinx's video, so if you haven't seen that, please go watch it. He kind of bears his soul for you guys, and I feel like it'd be disrespectful not to see that. As Jinx mentioned in his video, he's going to be focusing full-time on his career and then reevaluating later to see if we will be making more guides. Now, the channel initially was created while Jinx and I were both working on our careers full-time and doing YouTube as a side thing. So it's not unusual or unheard of for Jinx to reevaluate it and decide that he's okay with putting out some guides. So don't get too discouraged. But again, I fully support him if he decides that he can no longer do this. Now for some other kind of content that could be coming out in the meantime, Jinx and I have been playing Genshin together on the Twitch channel. If you want to see that live, you can follow at twitch.tv forward slash tuner. What we've been doing is gathering ores a couple times a week. And what we do is we kind of just talk about whatever. And a lot of people have been asking for that to be uploaded to the YouTube channel as a podcast. So if you're interested in that, let me know. If you watch it, please let us know what you think. But uh, that could be something that we're doing for a little while now. It's low editing effort. It can come out quickly without any stress. It doesn't really require much thought. Another series of guides that Jinx and I have been talking about are the best supports you're not using. A lot of people sleep on some of the better supports in the game because they think that all four-star characters are useless or free characters are useless. So we would like to correct a bit of that information in the community as well. Mostly inspired by people's lack of desire to use Kaya, who is one of the better supports in the game, five stars included. In some ways, I feel like I'm losing my friend of two and a half years. But as I said, I fully support his decision. And if he's unhappy doing this, then I want him to get better. Because having him be unhappy is worse than any of this going on right now. And as an aside, I do want to say that this issue isn't any one thing's fault. This is a combination of everything going on, and no one person is to blame exclusively. I do want to thank you guys for all the support that you've given the channel for the past two and a half years. Through Monster Hunter, Genshin Impact, and even the occasional Apex Legends video. <laughs> You guys have been there for us, and we really do appreciate it. Whatever we're doing going forward, just know that you guys were a part of our lives, and we will always remember this for whatever time we have. Thank you very much. Have a great rest of your week.